Hello everybody, welcome back to Resident Evil 2. I'm Kara aka Griffin Puff and I'm here with Tony. AKA TT Burry 8 and we're in the dark room right now. We didn't save because I don't think we need to save. And of course that locker is locked, the special kind of keys required. So just go out. Go in, go out this wooden door and go up the stairs. And I'm actually impressed that there's we have there's no I mean they actually impressed me that 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 there's no zombies in, in, in this area yet. We're gonna take this, combine them. I got I, I I put the one with with the red herb mixed with the green herb in the storage in, in storage because I just because like I'm I'm save it for later in case of an emergency. Not leave the dark room open door open. Yeah, I know I know you you'll ruin the pictures if you do. Yeah, the low times are a little bit. I feel it's like the width for the stairs. The low times are a little, are a little bit bit faster this this time. We still never figure out what's in this door. We still never figure out. I wish we could, it'd be cool, but but that that's like beating a dead horse. Let's get the virgin heart gem from that from from the statue raising his hand. Yeah, I think yeah, I don't know if you I, I know you're not playing, but the controls here it was one it was another thing that Resident Evil 2 improved on from the first game is the controls feel a little bit smoother. Just a little bit smoother when it comes to like like pushing items and stuff. And of course the improved voice acting as well, which I, I was okay with uh, the bad voice acting and stuff. And oh, I, oh yeah, here we go. Let's go. Let's go, go, go. Come on. Hopefully I didn't push it too far to the right. Oh no, we didn't. We're good. Like, get, thankfully it resets itself, but yeah, take it off. Now let's get the virgin heart. We're gonna go into the star's office first. I just hope to God that. Well, I think we're gonna have have to make a trip back to to the to the chess star's office. And we're gonna see Leon here. If you were following the Leon A campaign, a walk, let's play. Leon. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not gonna find your brother here after all. This time, we're gonna actually read it again, and I'm gonna read. We're gonna read the diary again because I like reading it, and because. Those who didn't catch the catch the catch the Leon A let's play. Chris's diary. August 8th. I talked to the chief today once again, but he refused to listen to me. I know for certain that Umbrella conducted T virus research in that mansion. Anyone infected turned into a zombie. But the entire mansion went up in that explosion, along with any incriminating evidence. Since Umbrella employs so many people in town, no one is willing to talk about the incident. It looks like I'm running out of options. August 17th. We've been receiving a lot of local reports about strange monsters appearing at random throughout the city. This must be the work of Umbrella. August 24th. With the help of Jill Valentine and Barry Burton, I finally obtained information vital to this case. Umbrella has begun research on the new G-Virus, a variation of the original T-Virus. Haven't they done enough damage already? We talked it over and I decided to fly to the main Umbrella headquarters in Europe. I won't tell my sister Claire about this trip because doing so could put her in danger. Please forgive me, Claire. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. Right. One last thing. Right. Here's a radio. Take it. If we were doing Claire A and Leon B, we'd be seeing that we, way they would meet in a different room. Happens. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Hmm. Let's see what's over here. We get the diamond key, but oh, gr gr uh, great. We are out of room. Oh boy. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. It's a bow gun. We'll have to come back to this. Oh boy, I hate I hate when that happens. Oh boy. I to. Like I go back and do the virgin gems, right? Yep, but
but we're gonna go into the library first. And just reading some facts. Some facts. The bow gun here isn't, isn't really necessary, but it's just good to, good to have if you want some items and want extra weapons and such. I don't even like the bow gun, but I just want to get it anyway. Nah, I don't need to. I read this before. Just leave. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, shit. Oh, we hear a scream. It's a little girl. You probably recognize her from the ending cutscene. Yeah. That's Sherry Birkin. You actually get to play as Sherry and Lee in, in Resident Evil 6. But I don't like playing as her. Run. Don't even try. What the? He did not want to die. I know. God damn it, I, it, it tricks you into thinking that. We don't have to use the, use a key. We can just go right through. Oh shit, we're in the, we got into another, another death trap. They're hungry. Coca-Cola. Ooh. I know what to do. We're gonna we're gonna do this easy. We got them all. Look at that. Did you see that? So easy. Simple. Now we got some room. I, I think we can have room for the bow gun. Sherry escaped through that small little hole in that door. If only, if only, see, you don't need those keys. Hmm, might as well take them. But, however, I think we can go back and get that bow gun now. Oh wait, no, we can't yet. We'll have, we'll have to go back there later. Yeah, a lot of backtracking. Let's go in this wooden door. We saw, we saw a few of these in, in the last game. Uh-oh, that's not good. See what happened there? Remember when we put the shutter over that uh, thing? Yep, it blew on us. It blew on us. That's the bummer part. What's in here? I don't need that right. Do I need... I'm not going to take a chance of combining it. You can't combine two red herbs. Two green herbs and a red, red herb. It doesn't work. We can't go up there. We can we can go up there, but we can't. There's nothing we can do. We gotta do it. And we mind I same thing. Why I hit it again. We get a stones, like I said. Instead of instead of plugs, we get stones, and they're used in a different room this time. Claire can't access the room, the room where where we get to control Ada the first time. But we're good to go because actually we're kind of good to go. We're just gonna go through these double doors. Hmm. The question is, where am I gonna go now? Should I go down there? No, I I shouldn't. Like, you know what? I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna use up that diamond key and put and put the serpent stone away. We don't need it right now. Just wish I could. I wish I could have been able to like get the bow gun and stuff. I mean, like the bow gun is, is pretty much. I don't like using it. For like I said, but I just want to get it because you don't know when stuff that will come in handy. It's gonna be a little easier because we have the grenade launcher and stuff. Hey, I thought of something. Let's, let's let's do the virgin heart puzzle and just get that over with. We'll be able, be able to clear up a lot of room. We need two slots. Mm-hmm. The thing is, like, you know how Claire says we have to blow up the wall here? Well, she's able yeah. to blow up. She's able to blow up the wall. 
We need to find a bomb and a detonator and stuff. At least that, at least that, that thing is dead. Let's put them in inside the two princesses while the king opens up and gives, like, gives us an item. That's what I'm Same thing as before, but still. I like it. It's out. And we got half of a stone. There's there's the thing. That's how that's how they trick you. You can only need to find a total of three stones, but one of them is in one of them yet to find is in half. So you gotta find two pieces of the stone. Oh well oh that was that was your phone. We're yeah. gonna, I'm gonna put away this blue stone for now. I put away the blue stone for now. We're not gonna need it. I know there's um, we got the serpent stone, and half a stone. Yeah, and I know I know where the other stone is. It's in that room. We need to use the diamond key to unlock. But I'm trying to figure out if I should. But you know what I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna go and get that bow gun. I have plenty of room now. We got like three spots, three slots. I mean, let's go and just go and get it. We're gonna just just backtrack here a little bit and just we're gonna take a little detour back to the library. I'm dreading going into that into the room where we need the heart key to open the door because those zombies came through and the shutter blew on us. And that is something I'm not really really happy about happening. Grenade launcher. Yeah, I'm happy. Yeah, like thank God like, we only have six bullets. So we gotta use the wire. We used up all our acid rounds because I feel like like the acid rounds are are good on the zombies and stuff like that. When you loads of zombies, there is something cool with the flame rounds. They can actually they, actually, they can actually stay on fire and stuff until you until you you leave the room and stuff. As long as you don't don't run into run into Mr. X, aka the tyrant, for fine. We're gonna go get that thing. And Leon's gone. Get the bow gun. Tell me it how good. It doesn't it doesn't take up two slots. I was worried about that. <laughs> you and me both. I think we think we'll we'll use the bow gun in one in in the room in one of the rooms we're gonna unlock using the diamond key. At least we don't have to travel far to get back there. That's for sure. <laughs> oh crap, I forgot to check it. <laughs> now we did. Okay. What? There's nothing here. We can use this though. Plastic bomb. Love it. All I need to destroy the wall be blocked by the helicopter is a detonator. And I know and I have a feeling where I know where we can get it from. I hope the yard is nothing in here. Uh, do I have the bow gun? Let's, let's equip our bow gun here. Let's just let's see the bow gun. Use the bow gun. Yeah, but it, it look look at that. It takes up like it uses three three things at a time. That's why you can run ammo. Like let's get this thing. Get this. Combine it. It's a good thing we didn't take the red herb with us. Come on, are you kidding me? It's in, oh, it's in there. Oh, hello. Is it dead? There we go. Look what we found here. The detonator. We got now, we have to combine both of them. There we go. Beautiful. So, let's see, let's look, let's check the lockers. Marvin's already dead, so Leon already killed him. Take this. Too bad I couldn't find any more rounds of like for the grenade launcher and stuff. 
Now let's just use that diamond key and then boogie, and then boogie, and then we can destroy the wall. Not even gonna bother going outside. I mean, I never went outside that door in in the B scenario because you don't need to. But imagine if, imagine if, if those are all dead. Don't need to bother here. No, um, mm -hmm. go in here, go into our orange door. I crack my hands there. Okay, let's use this. Now we, now it's useless. So hope yeah, we don't run into any, into any of those leechers. We may have to equip our, our grenade launcher just to be safe. We're gonna equip it just to be safe. So there we get a first aid spray. First aid. Yeah, yeah. Huh. And here we go. The Eagle Stone. Let's put this away. Then we're gonna let's put this away. We're gonna save, and then, then we're gonna do the next round. We'll do the next part then. Damn. Well, thankfully we're gonna go back up. We're gonna go back up to the waiting room and save there. Shame I had to use up one of my grenade rounds, but that's okay. Going to our little friends, the big blue doors again. Can't stop saying that. <laughs> what the? Where'd they come oh, from? Hello. Oh no. How oh, great. Nope, oh, out of bow. Out of ammo for the bow gun. Well, this is nothing that I can. I'm gonna use my gun. Oh man, I could have used my handgun. Why did I, did I not use the handgun? Why did I not use the handgun? I don't know. Forget about it. These things will, things will probably be, be dead soon anyway. Let's go up there, go to the waiting room, save. Then we'll do the next part. I'm putting away the uh, bow gun because it's, it's useless right now because we're out. Mm -hmm. Put this away. Put, oh. Put that away. Put this away. Get our ink ribbons and save and do the next part. And saving means we're gonna end this this part here, and we'll and this is this is Tony and Kara. We'll we'll be back for the next part.